All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more Daily 2K, and uh, just regular content, man. And But most importantly, what's up, all of my gym stars? What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Town, coming to you live with another video, man. Hey, look, I did just get up out the gym, man. Look, I look like old J8. I mean, I look like the new J8, old J. Old J, uh huh? But anyway, check it out, man. Before we get started, man, cheap, shameless plug, man. We got, look, man, y'all ask about the gear that we got. This Gym Star shirt, Jay, where does it get that from? Well, I'm glad you asked me that. Check it out, man. Come over here to the site. We got the Gym Star shirts, work harder, shine brighter. You can choose which, which color you want it to be in. You can choose, you know, what color shirts you want it to be. All of that good stuff, man. You can, hey, hey, boom. But better than that, we are updating things. And uh, look, we got the better sword and sorry, man. Look, with this, you can choose this, hoodies. All this stuff, man. Long sleeve, short sleeve. We're gonna make the whole site be like this pretty soon, man. So make sure y'all do that. And uh, also, look, we got the customized shirt, man. Look at the customized joint, man. You can put anything on your shirt as long as it's a PNG or something. If you can't zero the background, I just don't understand how to do it. That's cool. We'll hook it up for you. But check it out, man. You can literally, all you gotta do, find your image, download that image. And then, uh, hey, look, check it out. We're gonna take this Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer image that I got in here. Boom! Put it in here. It's gonna upload it. You make it be the size that you want it to be. Make it fit inside that joint right there, my bike. I said make it fit inside there. Hit it, bam. Choose what color shirt you want it on. You can do anything. You find your favorite picture, your favorite superstar, anything like that. That's all you gotta do, put it on now, man. And then we also got the NFL teams, man. So right now the only one we got is uh, the Steelers. But if you, if you, let's say you were to get this, Put it in the checkout. You can tell me, because I don't have a variety of colors, because I don't know. But when you get to the checkout, you can say uh Falcons Red. Like that. And then I, I would know what to do. So y'all make sure y'all, you know, hit check out the site, man. Breeze tees, all the hottest stuff, man. But look, that's all I have for y'all on that. But check it out, man. It seems that a challenge has been issued, man. So we gotta know, we gotta know who did it better, man, real quick. Check it out. Look at this. I saw this video today, and it said the Jabba Walk has got 24 hours to respond, man. This is talking about the Hawks' ability to stabilize. You know how birds... I've always wondered how when birds fly, they don't be doing that right there. And it's like when they move, you know, they got the, the whole thing going on. So they, they their body doesn't move. The body moves or whatever, but their head don't move. So I, I saw this video. I thought it was cool as hell. And he said, hey, he did that right there. Hey, my man said the job of walking got 24 hours to respond. They said, I right, bet. Woo, look at that neck work. Check the shoulder work. Ooh, check the neck work. Uh, uh, and they did them shirts in vinyl. Boy, whoever did that, they know, they know about some real stuff right there. All that stuff is done in vinyl, too. If it's good enough for the job of it's good enough for y'all. Look at that thing. Boy, he got that. He is dog go, ooh, <laughs> And we ain't talking about the network or the network. Who ain't gonna pat him on the head in the air, man? Who y'all think did it better? Was the Hulk or the Jabberwocky? I mean, the Hulk is 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 actually is is naturally predisposed to do that because that's what he's supposed to do. But I, I don't know how they do that, man. They don't they don't be fine when they do it though. When they do, all, I, I I don't know. It's vital. Who did it better, the Hulk or the Jabberwocky? Y'all let me know down in the comments. Anyway, first up, man, Tyceno finally hit 81, 81 streak. Rest in peace, Kobe and Gigi, all the others who passed away in the helicopter. I love y'all. Remember to always fight for your goals, dream big, and find your own Mamba mentality. And look, 81 game streak, man. Ticino with the logo and the 81, 81 game streak. They got it. He's been going for it the last few days. It's been kind of rough on him because they got one time they got, I think there's somebody VIP'd him. One time, uh, Z got uh, error code. Tysino got an error code, and then uh, they got stopped by an up, uh, uh, update required one time. So glad that those guys are able to do it, man. When you put your mind to something and you try to do it, most of the time you can't accomplish it in one way or another. It's not going to be an automatic win just because you put your mind to it, like people try to tell you. But you know, put your mind to something, set a goal, 
keep pushing, figure out how you're gonna get to that goal. That's the most important part. And uh, push for it, and, and you can accomplish just about anything within the realm of possibility. Up next, man, we got my boy Tay26. My boy Tay26 says, look, um, he said at Baluba on the 8th and the 24th of each month, y'all should turn the wreck into the Mamba Rec Center. And, and you see, like, somebody made, um, I guess, I don't know if this is a computer mod or if somebody made their own arena like this, but they made, they pretty much made the uh, Mamba Sports Academy or what have you like that. And I think it's pretty dope, man. It's a pretty dope idea. Um, obviously, you know, with the limited resources that you have, you can only do but so much. But uh, I, I think this is something, I think this is something where they can really do and implement it into the game. And I don't think that's on the 8th and the 24th of the month. They should just do it. Just turn the rec center. It ain't the Jordan Rec Center anymore. It can just be the Mamba Sports Academy or the Mamba Rec Center. And they can just do it just like that and just leave it. They changed the jerseys on Christmas. They already, they already, already always be changing stuff, you know, with the rec center anyway. So we know they have the capability and the wherewithal to do it. Y'all can't tell us that you can't do it, 2K. And since y'all don't want to get a Kobe jerseys away, I swear to God, bro, I promise you 2K is sitting there right now contemplating we should drop these Kobe jerseys. Somebody, I know somebody said it. We should drop these Kobe jerseys in the store because everybody wants them. Obviously, there are videos out there on how you can get it and do it yourself. All you have to do to get it yourself, go to a team that don't have 8 or 24 retired, choose which number that you want, take that number, and then you go buy the Lakers jersey with your name on it, change your name to Brian, and you're good. But the thing is, 2K doesn't want to drop the jersey because they're going to tax your ass 30 grand to 50 grand for the jersey when they know damn well it should be free. It's, it's a PR move because they know they can make a whole bunch of money off the jersey, but they don't want to seem money hungry as hell. 2K, do the right thing. Drop the jerseys for right. Damn it, I said for right. Or, 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 or something light that you know everybody got, 1BC. 15, how much y'all think the jersey should be, man? They should drop 8 and 24, the 8 and 24 Kobe jersey, and it should be free. But they don't want to feel like they're trying to make money off of the whole situation. That's what it is. It's a PR thing. It ain't because they don't want to drop the jersey. It's because they don't want to seem like bad people. So if you don't want to seem like bad people and don't want to seem like you're trying to take advantage of something, drop the damn jerseys for free, 2K. They should be for free. Or what's a reasonable price? Cause I think zero VC is reasonable. Y'all done got $500 off of me on this damn game already this year. So I'm, it don't matter how much y'all charge for it anyway. You know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna go to my career and get enough VC to do it. The VC is free, but I just feel like, like, like I, that's exactly why they haven't dropped them yet. That's the real reason that they haven't dropped them yet. Cause they're trying to figure out, damn, we can't monetize it because we are gonna look like dicks. But at the same time, we can't give it away for free. When in actuality, you can give it away for free. You give away all this other bum ass stuff for free that we don't want. Give us this for free. Throw us a freaking bound here, 2K. Throw us a freaking bound. Anyway, but like I said, it would be the least that they could do to um to change this to the Mamba Academy. Uh change it to Mamba Academy Sports or the Mamba Rec Center or whatever. I don't know what, what loopholes you gotta go through. I don't know who you have to clear what type of clearing house. You gotta go through because obviously there are gonna be copyrights involved and it can't be. I obviously, nothing is ever that simple. I understand that. And maybe they're trying to get something clear to get the jersey in the game, but Kobe's already in the game. So his jersey's already in the game, so we just need to be able to get it. Just give us access to it, 2K. We'll be the bitch. Anyway, up next, man, last but not least, NBA 2K Toots, man. He did a video. Y'all go over there and check it out. Link is in the description. This is the name right here, NBA 2K T U T E S. Go over there. He did an excellent video on a badge that I was intrigued by, but uh, it ended up not coming to fruition, the cross-key score. The reason that I was always intrigued by this badge is because y'all know I do baseline reverse off one, and I do baseline layups and all of that stuff. But the problem is it doesn't work on those things. It only works, uh, it don't work on layups and it doesn't work on baseline reverse dumps. The only thing it works on is shots taken across the key, layups across the key, all that stuff. If you want a more in-depth look into it, make sure you go by his channel. Check it out. Let me know what y'all think. But back to this damn, back, back, back to this damn 2K trying to hold us with the, um, oh yeah, make sure you go over there and subscribe and, 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 and like the video and all that good stuff. Back to this thing though. Do y'all think that that's the reason that they haven't dropped it yet? Because they try to figure out how they can monetize it without looking bad, looking bad. There's no, I mean, let me say y'all some time 2K, there's no way. 
you're gonna get some backlash either way, but hey, we at least we'll buy. Just put the damn jersey in the game, even if you're gonna drop it for 10, 10K or 20 grand uh, VC, whatever you're gonna drop it for, just drop the jerseys. If it's, if it's anything other than free, you're going to look bad. But I bet you anything, that's the reason that they holding off on it because they just like, if we do it, we just gonna look bad. But I, I, you, I can't get that out of my mind. Can't get it out of my mind. Wow. Think about it, get a lot of sound. Wow, wow. That's what I think, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments. Anyway, man, I gotta get up out of here, man. Um, I actually gotta go out in the field today and do some work. Y'all let me know who did it better, man. Did the Hulk, did the Hulk do it the best? Ew, look at that neck work! Look at the neck work! That's why that thing got the neck work like Keanu Jones, boy, guy, guy! Or did the Jabberwocky do it? That's a Hulk. It says Hulk right here. I think the guy that's holding it knows it's a Hulk. Yeah, it's a Hulk. I know what a Hulk is. I'm from Atlanta. It ain't scoring no, look, I can tell what a Hulk is. It's in Atlanta and it's not scoring any fucking buckets. So I know it's a Hulk. Anyway, up next, uh, or the Jabberwocky, did they do it the best, man? Maybe if they named that Hulk Trey Young and the scope some buckets, I don't know. Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. Who did it better? And uh, who did it better, number one? Uh, does 2K need to drop those jerseys? What price would be acceptable? Because we know they're gonna, you know they're gonna monetize them. And uh, last but not least, um, uh, you know, should they change it to the Mamba Rec Center this year or next year or just forever and ever? Uh, and uh, like I said, shout out to Tysino for that for the for the streak, man. Uh, keep doing your thing in the community, and uh, I'm holla y'all next time. Till next time, it's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Town. God speak.